What's up, everyone? I'm Jalen Sin. And I'm Kaylee Moore. And, and welcome, welome back to your Power 94 Team Report. Kaylee, I can't believe that it is our last year doing reports for Power 94. I can't either. That means we'll have to make this the best year and make it special. Tyner Academy has now proceeded in their efforts of getting a new building. That's right. The seniors here at Tyner Academy have called on local leaders after organizing a walkout. Tyner Academy has already collected $25 million in ESSA funds going towards the reconstruction of a new school, but the seniors will be watching the commissions voting closely tomorrow to earn between $29 and $7 million. The deadline for construction is August of 2024. Hey, Jalen, do you know what time it is? No, not really. It's student council time! Oh yes, our correspondent A. Sean Johnson will be covering our candidates on the campaign trail. Their motive is to save Tyner. Join her every Friday. Ram Sports! The Ram train got to rolling as we faced Grundy County. Before the event, students organized an outdoor pep rally to celebrate the first home game of the school year. The Tyner Academy Rams beat the Grundy County Yellow Jackets 14-52 with our very own JaVel Woodruff making headlines. And that's it for another Power, Power 94, 94 Team Report. Report. I'm Kaylee Moore. And I'm Jalen Sims. Have a great day, everybody.